what's up you guys this is civil disobedience bringing you the latest i want you to subscribe to my channel sherlock homegirl i want you to give this video a thumbs up we're going to be talking about reality hip-hop love and hip-hop miami specifically nikki natural and her dichotomy that she's established herself with trick and trina so i want you guys to make sure you leave your thoughts and opinions below and hit the bell for notifications so first i think a lot of people because i love to hear commentary from other bloggers and other people who react forget what it is to be legendary this has nothing to do with trina okay this has everything to do with an established reputation in the game First and foremost, Trina came out at a time when female rap was the number one thing going on. And for a while, before Nicki Minaj started popping with Young Money, the only person who was still putting out up-to-date music was Trina. Now, I'm not talking about in the sense of what you hear where they're from. If you're a New Yorker, of course, New York radio is going to play your music. If you're from Louisiana, of course, the Louisiana radio is going to play your music. But when you are from a certain place, she's from Florida. We were hearing her music everywhere. Okay. Look back at it. Okay. Put my left foot in the game now. Put my right foot in the game now. Come on now. This is when most female rappers had fell silent. So Trina is a legend. Okay. The only reason why Nikki Natural has a problem with Trina is because Trina is Joy's cousin and Joy is Trick's wife still. It don't have nothing to do with her disliking Trina. When that little girl sat down with Trick and Joy, she made it look like Trina was only treating her the way that she was treating her based off of being Teen Joy. And I'm bringing this back to everybody's recollection because everybody's looking at it like Trina ain't got no reason to be hot. That woman is set up and watched this whole season and she's watching this little girl play games like people ain't about business, okay? Keep in mind that Trina kept the business relationship with Trick after Joy and Trick fell out. So why would anybody have to assume that Trina would have to be hostile towards any female based on Joy? I don't know. Nikki didn't even put her best foot forward on the stage. She hit antics. She didn't rap all of a song. She didn't pull a Sukiana. Okay, I never heard of no Sukiana. And now, baby, I'm a Sukiana fan. So what Trina was doing as a Miami, Florida legend was helping Miami female rappers have an opportunity to say, forget what dude I'm dealing with. These are my skills. And Nikki Natural off of the strength of a trick daddy cosign expected Trina to move, turned off Trina's mic, called her out of her name, said she wasn't going to do a second number, and all of that simply because she's having sex with Trina. And we got R. Kelly locked up because bitches was thinking they were supposed to get something from Dick. Let me know what you think. Because in my opinion, I believe that Nikki Natural was totally disrespectful. I feel like Trina had every right to be upset. And with it being the type of game it is, hip-hop, you can expect some hostility and beef. Leave your thoughts and opinions below. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, Sherlock Homegirl. This is Civil Disobedience. Hit that bell for notifications. Peace.